friends, it's Quenby, the Grateful Queen, here on YouTube. Welcome back! I'm so glad you're here and that we are going to get a little bit of time together as I open this Jomar wholesale box. Yes, friends, this is a Jomar unboxing and review. Let me tell you the details of this box, then we'll open it up and we will see what is in the box! I need a better line for like, open it up and see what's in the box. like. That's so obvious. I feel like I need something a little better than that. the channel, please know that I do include the bloopers at the end of my video. I started doing that, I don't know, a few months back when I realized I make so many bloopers that they're taking up like more film than the actual video or something. Stay to the end so we can laugh at me and have a great time. Look at this box piece, like, like it shouldn't be in the video. Okay, you guys know that Jomar Wholesale is one of my absolute favorite places, hands down, to source inventory online for my reselling business. I'm a part-time reseller and I sell on eBay and Poshmark. This box I got with eBay in mind because this is a box of women's comfort shoes. Comfort shoes sell like crazy for me on eBay. Um, the details of this box are, it just says, women's comfort shoes, pre-loved, so they're pre-owned shoes. These are not new with tags. I got 10 pair. And the, it was a really good deal. This box sold out pretty quickly. Um, 10 pairs was $55. I paid $35 shipping. I had a discount code. Always use a discount code. My discount code is the Grateful Queen. all one word. You'll get 10% off. So don't shop on Jomar without a discount code. Use my code. Use somebody's code so that you can get a deal. My total was $76.32. I'll pop up on the screen what that is, but it's less than $10 for a pair of shoes. Comfort shoes I can usually sell on eBay, depending on the brand, but you know, between $25 and $75. I'm peeking in this box and it says pre-owned, but the shoes look like to be in really great shape. So giddy up. No, that's not right. Not giddy up. Get ready, friends. Let's dive into this box and see what I got. Um, like this, I just want to show you how these are coming. Like. Okay, these look new to me. This is a great brand. The brand is Naturalizer. I'll show you here. Sometimes it takes a minute for my camera to focus, but there we go, focused. Naturalizer. These retail around the $100 mark. Um, these are a US 7.5, the Vanessa. Let me know in the comments, do you love when they put the name of the shoe? I do. These are maybe, like a, these are silver and they're kind of perforated. They have a little bow detail, but look at these. I'm going to list these probably as new without tags because there's like no sign of wear on these. That's gorgeous. And these are gonna be great for spring, summer. I'm filming this in April, the beginning of April, 2021. I don't know about you friends, but I am starting to look online for things that I want for this season. I've been looking at maxi dresses, which are gonna be really hot again in 2021. I'm looking at my sandals and feeling like I need to update, I wanna update my wardrobe. And if I'm doing that, many, 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 many. Oh my gosh, I just poked in and saw my favorite personal brand. So this brand is Earth. Um, there's a shoe store by me called Soul Desire where they sell all the really expensive shoes. These shoes are like over $150. I buy this brand for myself personally. I don't go to the Soul Desire because it's too expensive. I find them on eBay. These are um, a size 7.5, the Aloha Wide. Ooh, I like having things like wide and narrow because people are looking for them. So if you have a, a particular foot size, like wide or narrow, you might go on places like eBay, Poshmark, Macari, you know, to find your shoes because you can't walk into any thrift store and find them. Also, if you have a larger or smaller size foot, these are gorgeous. And again, look at the tread on these, Jomar. These look like new without tags. I mean, they're gorgeous, gorgeous color. Those I can, I, I can probably get like 40 bucks for. Thank you, Jomar. 
Okay, these look like a pair of shoes. Another really good expensive brand. I don't know how to say it though. Is it Rika? Is this what I'm thinking of? Is this like a German brand? Um, this is a, these show a little bit of wear. These are like a slip on sneaker. Comfort look like they have like a memory foam sole. They just have a little bit of like dirt um, on the tread. I'll clean them up really quickly and easily. I clean all the shoes. I clean all the shoes that I sell. Even if they just need like um, a sanitizing wipe, I'll do that. But I'll scrub them, I'll polish them. I clean them all up. I'm gonna have a big old pile of shoes here in my office. I don't know this brand. Do you guys? Array? God, Jomar, these are in really great shape. A-R-R-A-Y. I'm not familiar with that brand. Let me know in the comments if you are. This is a women's loafer. Again, I'm so impressed with the condition of these. Look at these. Gorgeous brown slip-on leather shoe. And I, I will put in my title and description comfort shoes. I am 45 years old. I've, I've got to the place in my life where I want comfort shoes. I want to be stylish. I'll still wear a wedge or a platform or a little heel, but I'm not going to be agonized in my shoes anymore. Let me know off the comments if you're with me, if you know what I'm talking about. There was a time when I would squeeze myself into any shoe to go to a wedding or whatever. I'm not doing it anymore. I want stylish, beautiful shoes, high quality, but I need comfort. If you're one of the women that gets to wear beautiful stiletto heels and you can do it, I'm so envious of you. You're awesome. This is that same shoe, the same shoe in a black. What if my mom will like any of these? She's someone who loves to wear heels, but, and she's so hard to get into the comfort shoes. Mom, why won't you wear the comfort shoes? 7.5, just in black. And I wanna make sure you have taken a moment to subscribe to the channel. I do tons of unboxings from Jomar Wholesale, B&G Trading, Shop Goodwill, Thread Up. I've got an entire playlist of unboxings that you could check out if you're like me and you love unboxings. I do a lot of reseller related content. I do a live every Friday. Would love to have you, so make sure you've subscribed, liked the video, left me a comment, all those things. Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you. I don't know why I'm doing this. Let me know in the comments, do you guys sell shoes? How do you do with them? The thing I'm really appreciative about this particular box from Jomar is the shoes look like really clean and in really good shape. I don't think I'm gonna have to do as much work. That's something that holds me up sometimes is that I get the boxes, then I have to clean them all. And then I have to take photos. It's like, it's just like extra steps that I struggle with. So I'm appreciating that these are, are um, clean. Wow, look at these. So these are Hush Puppies, another really popular uh, comfort shoe brand. And again, look at the condition on these. Just gorgeous. They're like a blue leather with a flower detail there. And they still have the paper and whatever this thing is. What is this, like a shoe shaper? I don't know, to me these look new. Like these these look like new shoes. I might be able to sell these as like new without tags. Um, I'm looking for the size real quick because sometimes you guys message me and say, I need those hush puppies, baby. These are a US 7 leather. Gorgeous, gorgeous shoes. Okay, I love selling shoes. I love the profits. I don't love all the extra work. Another pair of naturalizers. I mean, these look new to me. I mean, oh, they've got a lit, like they look like they were worn around the house or something. A little bit of dirt there. A white leather slip on shoe. So if I paid less than $10 each, I know I can get at least $20 for every pair of these shoes. That's on the low end. My guess is I'm going to shoot for around like $35 with most of them. Um, so that is a lot. That is a good return on this box. Check out Jomar. They have so they have pre-owned boxes, new with tag boxes. Use my discount, look the Grateful Queen and get yourself some good stuff. Okay, another pair of Hush Puppies. Ooh, I like these ones a lot. Um, these are a slip-on black, like a ballet flat is what I would call these. These look super comfortable too. These do have a little bit more wear on them. These are an 8.5. Um, these have a little bit more wear on them. These need a little bit of cleanup. There's just a little bit of like stuff inside that needs to be Polished up, clean up, but like a really beautiful, versatile. People love these ballet flat type shoes. Ballet flat type shoes? Do you love ballet flat type shoes? Okay, here's a brand I'm not familiar with, so that's fun for me. I've been reselling 10 years, and it's fun to still learn new stuff. These are S-I-K-E-T-U. Sick-a-two? Anyone heard of this? 
I don't know what these are, but they're really pretty. These are like a slip on um, sandal, but look at the embellishment. Beautiful like rhinestones or something, just a really pretty sandal. So this is like a comfort shoe, but they're also really, really pretty. Those are nice. These look a little bit smaller. Uh, 38, no, that's usually like an eight. Hmm, that's my size. Last but not least, this is another brand, another go-to soft, but it's spelled S-O-F-F-T. A really great brand. I can usually get around 25 for these. These are pretty. This is a, a patent leather um, with a gold accent, like a slip-on, just a tiny heel on those. So again, a comfort shoe that's still really attractive. I think I'm gonna make a lot of money on this box Thank you, Jomar. Check them out. They've got a ton of different stuff. I have a link below, a discount link. Let me know what you think of this box and these brands. I think I'm going to do well on it. Feeling really grateful. <laughs> Thanks for spending time with me. Make sure to like the video. Make sure you're subscribed, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye-bye. 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 Seriously, this box. I, I think what I what I would need to do is like put it together like this, and like take all the shoes out, put it together, and then I could haul without the box flap. But you know what? Sometimes you just get into the haul. You're excited to see the stuff. And Big check of the weird bang situation. I I thought I bangs were doing better, but they're just all over. Like these, like my, the ones I buy from Earth are a little more platformy, but. Now these feel a little bit big. Gosh, they really are pretty. Like, no, don't do not do that in the video, no. Love a good shoe box. I love selling shoes. Don't like all the extra work, but love selling shoes. So I just put them at the end. Stay till the end. Stay till the end. We'll laugh together. I've got to get better at this. Let me find a, I don't know how a better way to do it is. Let me just see. Yeah, let's get this party going. Box issues. All right, friends. No, it's nice out. Mm, mm, mm.